guys so it's Britt back at again with another video today is day seven of 12 days of Christmas and to me I feel like the days are skating like what are we in a rush for Christmas is literally next Monday how is time real anyways like yes we are back again with another video um today is a little chill little vibe I'm just gonna do like a little this or that Christmas edition so if you're interested or you want to know what I prefer anything Christmas related stay tuned and continue watching so I have my iPad here and I have some this or that questions regarding Christmas things so the first one is Christmas away or Christmas at home I don't know about y'all but Christmas at home has literally been tradition, just like coming together with family. But I feel like Christmas away, like doing a cruise, a family cruise during the holidays would be so much fun. Like you don't have to worry about cleaning up. You don't have to worry about like preparing for the guests because y'all are on vacation. Y'all can relax. Y'all can chill and just take it day by day. You know what I mean? Enjoy your time together and all that. Like I feel like that would be such a nice vibe for the holiday season going into the new year. I think I'm gonna do that next year though. High key. We have to travel during Christmas because I've never, I mean, I've been away from home, but like with family, but it wasn't like on a vacation. It was just like we're meeting up. You know what I mean? All right. So the next one says real tree or artificial tree. Personally, I've never had a real tree, but I feel like I would want to at least try it once because I know it's a hazard, it's a fire hazard. If you're not careful because you know you always have to make sure that it's watered properly and all that but I feel like the fresh scent of the tree would make you feel all the feels for the holidays like I would love to try that but I know it's high maintenance I know it's high maintenance but I've always had an artificial tree but I desire to try a real tree one year okay so this is a song this or that so all I want for Christmas is you or last Christmas of course, we gotta go with Mariah. All I want for Christmas is you is a bop and it will forever be a bop. Like, sis has literally set her life up forever. She doesn't need to do nothing else for the rest of her life. Just live off of that song. Because it's gonna come in rotation every Christmas. And she's gonna get paid every Christmas for the rest of her life. <laughs> and I love that for her. I love that for her. Okay, so the next one is gifts or food i'm a foodie at heart i'm gonna just say that i'm a foodie at heart but i love a good gift hmm i would have to say because my love language is um gift receiving and giving if that makes sense so i don't know i'm gonna have to go with food though because i love food i just love food i love trying new food and I've come a long way because growing up, I hated, like it took me so long to try sushi because my sister was always put onto it and we're like eight years apart. So she's older, of course. And she used to always eat sushi. I'm like, girl, how? The texture just looks crazy. But now, honey, any opportunity, I want sushi and I'm gonna get it. <laughs> but the next one is decorating the tree or wrapping the gifts. Um, I'm gonna have to go with decorating the tree because wrapping the gifts is a task like if you're not skilling it it's just gonna look a hot mess I mean I do the best I can and it looks presentable but it's just like it takes so many tries like girl get it together you've been wrapping gifts for a while now so where's the progress <laughs> no but for real, like decorating the tree has to be one of my faves um is it mold or mule? I think it's mold wine or a hot chocolate. Not sure I've ever tried that wine before, but I don't really like hot chocolate like that. My unpopular opinion, I don't really like hot chocolate. So I'm gonna do the wine. Um, Advent or the 12 days of Christmas? Uh, just for the purpose of this series, I'm gonna say 12 days of Christmas. Um, next one is Christmas dinner or leftovers. Um, Christmas 
Christmas dinner hit now. Like, it freshly done and, you know, it's gonna hit. But the leftovers, when the season has marinated, that's just a different level of good. I don't know if y'all ever experienced that, but the leftovers always slap. And I know a lot of people have an ick about leftovers. They're just like, I don't want to eat the same thing. Not me, honey. Run it back, Turbo. <laughs> Run it back. Because one thing I'm going to do is eat leftovers. Now, it's pushing it up to like three, four days. But I'm going to eat leftovers. I'm not that girly to be like, no, leftovers is... Uh -uh. Hand me over the leftovers. The next one is the Elf movie or Home Alone. To know me is to know I'm going to watch Home Alone every Christmas season over and over again, multiple times throughout the season. I don't know. I just watch it like it's the first time I'm watching it. <laughs> that just gives me all the feels and the nostalgia. Girl, I just love Home Alone. Uh, Home Alone specifically, one, one and two. One and two always slap with the original Kevin. Um, I've never really watched Elf. I know, what is his name? Feral? Chow. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Um, is it Will Ferrell? Yeah, him. I've never watched it. It doesn't seem, I mean, I've watched seg like little pieces, bits and pieces of it, but I've never watched it full through and it, I don't desire to. It doesn't look like my jam. Christmas Jumper or Christmas PJs? Is that even a question? I don't even know what a Christmas jumper would even look like. I'm confused. Um, I'm gonna have to go with Christmas PJs for sure, 100%. Playing games or watching movies? What are Christmas games though? I'm gonna have to do the Christmas movies. Okay, so another movie, The Night Before Christmas or How the Grinch Stole Christmas? 1000% How the Grinch Stole Christmas. Definitely, but not the cartoon version. Not into it. I'm definitely into the Jim Carrey one because he is hilarious, okay? Colored lights or white lights? I'm definitely gonna go with white lights. The older I get, the more like simple and, you know, not doing too much, not overcrowding things that I, I gravitate to more. I don't know, I love a good pure white light. It's so like aesthetically pleasing and just simple and like, I don't know it just fits the aesthetic hot cocoa or eggnog i'm gonna have to go with eggnog and since i'm like dairy free um i found a few that are dairy free and they slap just as hard as regular eggnog so yeah um gingerbread house or sugar cookie you know <laughs> the funny thing is i've always wanted to like you know continue the tradition of building a gingerbread house every Christmas season but I don't really eat it but sugar cookies for sure I will definitely eat a sugar cookie yeah getting gifts or giving gifts <laughs> definitely giving I love to give a good gift because I'm very observant and I pay attention to details like if you say that you like something and it's coming close to like your birthday or like Christmas or like a special day to like celebrate you. I'm gonna like remember or take a mental note and I'm gonna gift you that gift that you basically just threw a little hint randomly, not even intentionally trying to like let me know that you like something, but I will take a mental note for sure and give you exactly what you want for sure. Um, red or green? For the Christmas holiday, I'm gonna have to go with red. Classic. Peppermint or cinnamon? Peppermint for sure. Um, I love a good peppermint bark. Peppermint bark is so good to me. Like, And I'm not even supposed to eat chocolate because I know it got dairy in it. But that peppermint bark every once in a while slaps. I'm telling you. But yeah, that's it for the This or That Christmas edition. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys tuning in each and every day. Um, how many days do we have left? Ciao. We have five days left. Five. We have literally five days till Christmas. That is insane to think. This year literally zoomed by so fast. That's crazy. 
But once again, I thank you guys so much. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and tell a friend to tell a friend to join in the fam. You know what I mean? Um, so yeah, drop down below what is your favorite this or that question and tell me what you guys prefer. And until tomorrow, I will see you guys later. Bye.